In this screencast, we're going to take a look at the new right to left feature of the DevExpress ASP.NET products. Now, this right to left feature is great if you have a website that needs to be deployed with a language that only supports right to left. And it's super easy to set up. So, say for example, I have a website here. Now, here I have a page that has the ASPX grid view bound to a simple access data source. And I'm simply grouping by the country field here, and I've enabled editing as well. Now, let's just take a quick look at this in action. So here, you can see that this is the standard grid. I can do things like sorting, grouping. I can even, let's say, group by city along with country, as well as editing. Now, if you have a localized site that you need to display with the right to left, the DevExpress ASPX grid view, as well as the ASPX editors, the tree list, and all the navigation controls in the ASPX experience suite now support right to left layout. Now, we're also going to be supporting this for all the other upcoming DevExpress ASP.NET products very soon. So, say for example I want to set this up for right to left. All I do is click on the grid, go to properties, and set the right to left property to true. Now, you may be wondering what that default option is. Well, right now I set the right to left feature for only the grid, but let's say I want to do it for all the DevExpress products in a particular website. Well, there's a much easier way to do this. If you go to the web config file, you'll see that there's a DevExpress section that has options for compression, themes, callback errors, and so forth. And the one you want to set is under settings right to left, and we'll simply, simply set that to true. Now save this, and let's take a look at this in action. Now, our grid should be appearing with the right to left layout, where all the items are aligned to the right side. Now, we still have the same grade functionality, so if I want to group by city as well as country, I can do that, as well as open up an edit form. Thanks for watching. 